Hey, what's up? It's your boy, 24-7 here with 24-7 Fusion Media. You know, yesterday I dropped a video about Zachary Levi not working out, not doing shit, you know, uh, in the gym or, or otherwise. And got a little blowback in the comment section, which I don't really give a fuck about. Because this, this is my thing here. If... If you're getting paid to play the role of, of a superhero and you got people out there like Dwayne Johnson, Henry Cavill, Chris Pratt, Chris Evans, Chris Helmsworth. When you got folks like that, that'll take this shit serious, even Ben Affleck, and you're basically doing what they're doing. You need to take this shit serious. Get your ass in the fucking gym. You get the, the studio will provide people for you. They'll have, they'll send you a nutritionist. You have money in the bank, which means you could pay for your own motherfuckers to help you work out. I don't want to hear that shit. And then uh, someone had nerve to say that I was body shaming. Look, if you're getting paid this kind of money and you're being, you're being put on a platform that the whole world can see you, uh, you need to be up to par. And if not, don't even fucking accept the role. Because I don't want to see no half-assed motherfucker looking like Captain Marvel or anything else. Shazam. So if you're going to accept the role, do the shit right. Go hard or go home. So all that other shit, I ain't trying to hear it. This motherfucker got money and he got people that can provide what he needs in order for him to be up there with the rest of them. So I don't want to hear it. So with that being said... Noah Centineo gets Jack to play Adam Smasher in Black Adam. Now that's what I'm talking about. Charlie's Angels 2019 actor Noah Centineo is getting into seriously super shape to play Just Society recruit Albert Rothstein, better known as Adam Smasher in the upcoming Black Adam film. His trainer, Kirk Mayers, shared videos of Centineo training on Instagram, tagging Centineo and his dog pound Jim. Myers wrote, super proud of legend at... Noah Centineo for making moves and smashing superhero training. Now, see, that's the shit I like to see, man. That's what I'm talking about. All right, all right. Let's go see what the fuck he's been doing in the gym. Oh, shit. That's what's up. He's taking care of his business. Fuck yeah. Look at that, man. On his personal Instagram account, Centineo shared his own post showing off the astounding results and playfully referred to himself as a thirst trap. Look at that shit, boy. Not bad, not bad. At least he's working hard on it. You can tell he's putting in the work, unlike other folks. Shit. Subjective or debatable, as you can call that self-compliment, the actor is trapping the attention of fans and former co-stars. Centineo's to all the boys co-star Lana Condor left a comment on the post reading, "No way, you looking amazing," punctuated by three fire emojis. His hard work is paying off and may come easy, based on lessons he learned to get fit. Given how Centineo had to bulk up much more intensely for another role prior to Black Adam. All right. He said, last time I gained, I was eating 6,500 calories a day, Centineo called and eating use. This time will not be as bad. The last time was probably for the Master of the Universe remake where he was scheduled to play He-Man. That project stalled, freeing him up to play Atom Smasher. That's right. That's right. That's right. He was supposed to be, he's supposed to be He-Man. So I don't see why he didn't keep it up, though. I don't see why he didn't keep it up, but obviously... He's been in shape before, so it wasn't hard for him to get into shape again, if that's what they're saying. Now he's training to keep up with Black Adam star Dwayne Johnson, and you can't argue with the whippersnapper's commitment. That's more than what can be said for Robert Pattinson in making the Batman, if only other rumors and allegations about his training and behavior hold water. Pattinson confessed in an interview to barely doing anything while in lockdown last year. See? Exactly my point. Robert Pattinson ain't doing shit. 
Same way Zachary Levi wasn't doing shit. I'm telling you, man. Lazy motherfuckers, man. According to some scoops, the Twilight Star showed up to the set and out of shape, making excuses and outraging director Matt Reeves. He was reportedly sent home for two weeks to gain more muscle mass, and that shut production down yet again. Yup, look at that. Black Adam has been delayed many times too, but it shouldn't have the same problems as the Batman. Large sets are currently being built as production begins ahead of newly announced summer of 2022 release. That's good to hear. So, man, what do y'all think about Noah Centineo getting into shape and taking his role seriously, unlike some other folks that we are seeing in the public eye that has the same responsibility but not taking the shit serious? Me? Hell, that's awesome as fuck. I mean, that's what he's supposed to be doing. He's doing exactly what he's supposed to do. What the fuck? He's going to walk in. Well, he's going to walk in to play a fucking giant called Adam Smasher. And he's going to walk in looking like Zachary Levi or fucking Robert Pattinson. Get the fuck out of here, man. I ain't trying to hear that shit, man. So all that body shaming bullshit. Nah, you, I'm not even trying to hear it just for the simple fact that if you're getting paid to play the role. The motherfucker, you got to put in the work, man. What the fuck? What? I, I don't I don't get it. I don't get it. What, what? People are allergic to the gym now? Stop being lazy motherfuckers, man. Get your ass in there and fucking hit the weights. Eat right. Shit. Take your shit serious for once. Yeah, y'all let me know what y'all think about this shit in the comment section below. Please share, like, and subscribe if you haven't already. It's your boy, 24-7 with 24-7 Fusion Media. And I'm out. Peace.